For those of you looking to create videos fast, templates are a great way to do it. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use them. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you CapCut using my phone. And it is an iPhone, but don't worry Android lovers, the process is exactly the same. Let's go. When using a template in CapCut, all we're doing is filling in the blank. We're taking a template we like and creating our own version of that video template using our own videos or photos. So there are two ways we can find template, either within the CapCut app, or you can import them from TikTok. So if you're scrolling on TikTok, you may see at the bottom of the screen, the CapCut icon with a little name of the template by it, like mini vlog. That basically means that that video is using a CapCut template that you can use as well. All right, the first thing we need to do is just open up CapCut. And on the home screen at the bottom, you wanna click the templates icon. And once you're in the templates dashboard, you'll be able to see that there's a lot of templates to choose from. For example, you can search for different categories or themes like Christmas or birthdays, we can find templates from creators you're following. We can even find viral templates used for Reels or for TikTok. There's so much in here for you to choose from. And if you're a business, you're in luck because there's even business related templates. So you can use templates specially made to advertise products or sales. So now I'm gonna show you how easy they are to edit. So I've searched for a vlog template because they tend to use a lot of photos or videos. And just so you know, for copyright issues, I can't play any of the audio on these templates, but they do have audio, so don't worry. So I found a template that I like, and all I'm gonna do is click use template. So now we're gonna customize up this template. And at the bottom of the screen, you can see a series of blank tiles. This is basically CapCut prompting me that I need to add 11 photos or videos to complete this template. And here's my little content creation tip to save you loads of time. What I've done is add all my favorite photos and videos to a content creation album on my phone. So whenever I edit a template, all I do is select that album and I know that all these photos and videos will be great. So let me show you how quick it is to customize up this template. So each blank tile shows how many seconds it will last. So when I add a video or photo to that blank tile, it will only last for that amount of seconds. So the first blank tile selected, so we're ready to go. All we have to do is select our photos and videos. So I'm gonna show you how quick this is. And when you're done, you just press next and you've created your video. But don't worry, you can still customize it up. If you're using a video, CapCut may not select the exact moment of that video you want. So to change that, all you need to do is select that tile with that video, go to crop, and you can change the size of the video and you can choose the part of the video you wanna use. So this is me in a fire test at work, great. I'm just going through selecting all the bits that I want. You can also change the volume of the clip and you can also replace the clip if you don't want it. There's so much customization when using a template. There's a lot of freedom and it just saves you so much time. Like I'll replace that with this. Great. There we go. I've customized all the videos exactly how I want them. Now on this template, you can't add any more audio. Some templates let you do it, but not on this one. However, I can edit the text. So I want to keep the word mini vlog, but I want to change the text. All you need to do is press the pencil button and I'm going to add the words that British girl. You can move around. You can change the font. You have so many options. I'm just gonna keep it like this to show you how simple and easy it is. And then we're gonna press export. But just an FYI, when it comes to the audio, the template probably has the best audio to match the timing of those clips. So personally, I would just use the audio that comes to the template. So now we're just gonna export our video and it's always best to export on the highest quality. So this video, the highest is 1080. And now you can save to device with a CapCut watermark, which I wouldn't recommend because no social media platform likes it when you have a watermark on the video. They don't tend to do as well. So I'm going to save and share to TikTok without the CapCut watermark. So it means that when I press this button, copy of the video gets downloaded to my phone without the watermark and I instantly get taken to TikTok where I can post it. So normally when it goes to the TikTok app, I just press next and go to drafts and I save that video to post it at another time when I have time. But if you don't want to post a TikTok, just close the app. But there we go. That's how easy and fast it is creating an awesome looking video using a template in CapCut. Pricing wise, there's a free and pro version of CapCut. But personally, I use everything on a free version. So try making a video using a template in CapCut and let us know how you found it in the comments below. And if you want to find out more about CapCut, we have some incredible advanced training and tutorials linked in the description. And did you know we have an amazing CapCut course? So if you want to become a pro in CapCut, check out the description box below for more information. Also, why not check out my channel? I'd love to see you over there. And let me know if you watch this video. I'm that British girl, Jordana Grace, and thanks for watching.